What's going on you all today? We're talking about how to stream your quest to wirelessly and let's get it. But first things first, you have to start the casting process from your headset. All you're going to have to do right here is you're going to hit the share button. Then you're going to go to cast. And in this menu, you need to ensure 100% that your computer and your headset on the same exact Wi-Fi network. Tap on the computer and then you're going to hit next right here. And when you hit next, it's going to start searching for the casting. And then you're just going to go to the desktop and go to Oculus casting. So you hit next right here. Now that the casting process is set up, we're going to have to go into the search engine. You're going to look for Oculus casting. I'm doing the Oculus casting right here. And it's usually the first one on your engine to show up. So you have to click on that. Remember, first you do the headset casting and then you get into this segment. Casting. After you have casted successfully, there's a main thing you have to do, mic volume and the game volume, the mini setting on this casting. And you're gonna see, you're gonna hit, you see this mic is gonna be muted out and the volume's gonna be muted out. You have to put both on. Now I put away my microphone. Now you're hearing everything right now through my Quest 2. And as long as the screen is right and everything, we need to do the next step. The next step being that you have to open up your streaming software, whatever streaming software that you're using for your stream. So let's go ahead and do that. As you can see it right here, you're going to see the main display page. This is the way it will look behind the scenes when you're creating your stream. All you're going to do is on your new scene, which is now your VR stream. Congratulations. You're going to add this plus sign right here. You see the plus sign. Now everybody's PC acts a little different, but all in all, they're the same. You're either going to go to window capture, game capture, or display capture. For this example, we're doing a display capture. We're going to add the source. You can title it whatever you want. Then when you title it, I keep it at automatic. I always keep a lot of things in automatic settings just because you don't want to mess too much or get too cute with VR settings because VR is already difficult as it is. So right here, you can see all my cursor moving around right here. And essentially, this is exactly what's going to be. But instead of you all seeing my OBS, my Streamlabs source, you're going to see this right here. And all you have to do is hit that setting turn it into a wide screen and you're going to hit a full screen right here and all in all what you're looking at right now is what your stream is going to be right here we have a camera a webcam integrated i have my logo right here you can add whatever scenes and stuff you want and basically you'll see it just like this so for an example i'm on right here like this and then you change it into that and this is how your stream looks you can grab your controllers you can just get on and do some stuff you can see me moving around now let's go over some things right let's go over some tips right always keep those recommended settings for twitch because you're doing a wireless vr stream with your quest 2 have fun add whatever you want and just like me earlier you saw me adding my microphone you can add a microphone if you wish that's up to you um That'll be just for your just chatting essentials before you get into VR. Because you get into VR, you can hear all the microphone noise going in through the Quest 2 already. This is what people hear. So everything you're hearing right now is how it sounds. So that's just the easy version of how you do it step by step. Casting, get it through in the casting, get your streaming software, then get it into a capture. And you're going to see it exactly like this. And you would see this menu and it'll look, but you can see it moving right now. But obviously I have... I have a double, I'm, I'm recording on top of recording. So yours is not gonna look like this. Yours instead will look like what we just did right now. Maximize and you can have scene changes and you can change it and you can see me change into like my other VR scenes and create. So all in all, this is basically how it would look if you wanna stream VR. You put a webcam, you have your VR going in. This is all wireless, very easy. Guys, let me know what's up. This is a very simplified way on how you can stream wirelessly on your Quest 2. Just a few steps. Giving us a thumbs up and comment and like. With that engagement, it helps us outreach others and really simplify the latest and greatest updated settings that you can see right here. Oh, no. Hold on real quick, all right? It looks like a busy village in here. So let me know what y'all think, man. Again, thank y'all so much for all the love and support. I'll be putting up more content. Let's, let's keep the positivity rolling. I appreciate y'all. Peace.